Am I going to regret uploading this video? Probably. <laughs> Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be telling a story about the time my crush rejected me. I actually uploaded a video about a year ago and it had the same title, My Crush Rejected Me Storytime. But in that video, I talked about a crush that I had on a boy in elementary school and how he rejected me. But this story time is going to be about a crush that I had on a guy in high school. And this was very, very recent. This happened like in the beginning of this year. I was still in high school. I I'm a college freshman now this happened when I was a senior. This story is pretty short so after I tell you guys this story I'm also going to be telling you guys a few more stories about just some embarrassing and awkward things that happened to me in high school because I'm a very awkward human being. Alright so story number one is how my crush rejected me. I just want to preface this by saying I have no hard feelings against this person and we are not friends okay that sounds like so shady but no i think the reason he rejected me is because we aren't friends i don't even really have friends that are friends with him so this guy was in my grade and i went to school with him since seventh grade we went to middle school and high school together or like most of middle school oh we have to think of a fake name let's call this crush bobby okay there was actually bobby at my school he was like a few years older than me i'm not talking about him i'm talking about someone in my grade so i liked bobby on and off from 7th through 12th grade like that's a long time i did have other crushes but i don't know i just like always went back to him you know what i mean it's is that bad? I don't know. So he was just really nice. That's really the only reason I liked him. He was really nice and I thought he was cute. So one day I finally got the guts to follow him on Instagram. Like that's not even a big deal. I add him on Instagram and Snapchat and he accepts my follow request but he doesn't follow me back. It was obvious that he did not like me because he followed other people back from my school and he followed my friends back but he did not follow me back. I followed other guys in my grade on social media and they followed me back and I didn't like them like that, you know what I mean? So after he rejected me, I went to school the next day and oh my gosh. Do not do this. Do not do this, okay? Learn from my mistakes. So. I was walking into school and he kind of would like stand near the cafeteria before school started and I would have to pass the cafeteria to get to my first period class. I would always see him and I didn't think he would look up but he looked up when I was going through the gates to go to my class because the bell was about to ring because I was like always late senior year. So as I was coming through the gate to go to my class he looked up and he saw me from a distance. Okay, usually I would just like look away or I'd pretend I didn't see him because I was like nervous. I was a shy girl who had a crush on this guy. Ugh. Okay, I'm sorry. He looks up and ugh, I glared at him because I was petty and annoyed that he didn't follow me back and I was hurt, okay, because I really liked this guy. Ugh. So do not do that. Do not glare at someone, okay? That's just rude, okay? I would never do that now. I have learned from my mistake. I am an adult, okay? So I literally glared at him and then just looked away. I probably looked like a total female dog, you know what I mean? I'm not gonna say the word. We gotta keep this G-rated, okay? Then I was still annoyed because I was like, why isn't he following me back? Maybe he just forgot. So I think I tried one or two more times so i unfollowed him on instagram and snapchat and then refollowed him again and he didn't add me back or follow me back he probably didn't add me back like the second or third time because i glared at him do not do that i promise i'm a nice person okay and i don't do stuff like that anymore just learn from my mistake don't glare at anyone especially your crush or they literally will not like you back so that's kind of how he rejected me i guess he like silently rejected me i know he like didn't specifically say like oh I don't like you he basically rejected me because he literally followed like everyone else from our school on snapchat and instagram but he wouldn't add me back and you guys might be like oh he didn't know who you were yes he did okay we had to sit next to each other in classes before all right so this next story I actually told on my snapchat so follow me on snapchat self promo I'm sorry I keep doing that voice so that's annoying so if you follow me on snapchat you might have heard this story already but keep listening because I left out an important piece of information because there's certain people that follow me on snapchat I didn't want them to know this part of the story but now I'm just letting it all out for the world to know I really don't care anymore so I was in one of my classes the teacher was calling roll when he said my name my voice cracked really really loudly he stops calling roll 
looks at me dead in the eyes and goes, you're going through a magical time in your life. <laughs> what the heck? I was so embarrassed. And this was third period. It was early in the morning. I was exhausted, still half asleep, honestly. Also, this happened senior year. My crush was in that class, so that's a part that I left out on Snapchat and I was just so embarrassed and like nobody understood why but it's because he was in that class. I wanted to run out of the classroom and cry like I'm not even kidding I'm such a baby but now I just look back and laugh at it it was actually super funny but in the moment and like weeks after I was so embarrassed. Okay so the third story is how unpopular I was senior year not senior year all of high school so I would get questions from you guys when I was still in high school at least a few of you guys asked me are you popular in school? And I'm just like, what? Me? No. <laughs> my class was pretty small. Literally 90 kids were in my class. I thought everyone knew each other and I thought at least everyone in my grade like knew my name, but apparently that's not the case. Let's backtrack a little. So my mom was helping sell prom tickets with other kids on the prom committee and she was talking to this guy and she was like, oh yeah, my daughter's Alyssa. And the guy was like, who? <laughs> this guy was in my grade. I don't know what grade he came to my school at. I don't know if he's been there since freshman year. I'm not sure. But also, we had classes together. And I was the TA for a class that he was in. And the teacher would like always call my name. I'm not trying to be like, oh my god, everyone should know me. Like, no, that is not what I'm saying, okay? But I knew everyone in my class because it was a small class. He told my mom something like, um, I've never heard of her. I don't know who that is. I knew his name, so I just thought that was really funny. To answer your question, no. I was not popular in high school. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna tell one more story. I have a few others, so if you guys want to see like a part two, just let me know. My friend and I were leaving school. We were walking out of the gate, and this kid opened the gate for us, but I was talking to my friend. I did not even see him. I thought my friend just like opened the gate for us. The kid who opened the gate at us yells at us and goes, you're welcome at the top of his lungs. I was shook. This kid was a sophomore at the time, so he was a year younger than me. I guess moral of the story is pay attention to who opens gates for you and doors for you because if you don't say thank you, they could yell at you. I know it's the proper thing to say thank you and I would have said thank you if I saw him. I literally did not see him. This is an interesting video. Today's post notification shout out goes to this person. Be sure to comment down below once you have turned on my post notification.